Hey guys, welcome back. Uh, we're doing a review on the Auto Gleam, Auto Gleam Polar Blast. I'll just bring it. There it is. There. Excuse the vape. Yes, I drive a Subaru. <laughs> yeah, we're gonna see how well this stuff works and give it a quick review. You can get this stuff at super cheap. I think it's like thirty or forty dollars. And yes, I need to clean my bench up. It's been flat out with work so yeah we're going to get this ball rolling with it I think it's you mix it I think it's like 50 to 100 mils I'm not 100% sure I'll have a look you mix it 100 mils of product to every 500 mils of water excuse me so I've just eyeballed it and got it all set up yes yeah, so it's a Bowden's own um, foam sprayer it's the exhaust off the old car so wash this thing all I know that pure wax wax is actually doing really well like it's magic that stuff so yeah uh, I'll get this stuff on we'll sit there and time how long it actually stays on the car and give my reviews on how well it actually goes. Ugh. As you can see guys, as you can see guys, um, it goes on quite thick. It's, yeah, it's been on for about four minutes now, so we'll see how long this goes. Oh, that's the other side. Let's see how long this goes and hose it off and hope for God it's probably cleaned the car because it only had white dust on it, so it should be all right. Uh, yeah, and if you've got a pod filter, make sure you cover it up. Learned that the hard time, the hard way the other day. Um, we had an issue with a bit of a miss and then found out there was a bit of water in the air filter so I put a bag over it so yeah so yeah um, we'll see how this goes and we'll go from there Hey guys, it's been probably close to nearly 10 minutes. It is still covered in this stuff. So we're gonna hose it off and see what's... Yeah, we gotta hose it off and see what's left. And, oh, fucking hell. <laughs> um, yeah, we'll go from there. Um, yeah, I'll hose it off and we'll see what, if it's taken the dirt off without touching the car with a sponge. As it was only light dust, so this stuff should have taken it off, but we'll find out. Hey yeah, guys, it's decisions time. Um, I move that a bit further away. Best way to put it, this stuff, it's doing its job. It did what it said it would do. The foam was fucking ridiculous. It was like shaving cream practically. So I highly recommend buying it. So now I'll show you guys the finished product. You can see the reflection of the ground. 
Right. Yeah, so if you're in the market for a decent snow foam, definitely get the Auto Gleam Polar Blast. They have got more range of other polar stuff, like they've got polar wash, which the polar blast is just meant to get the large dirt off the car. Then you can use sponge or whatever, but you can get one that's um, polar wash, which is another snow foam, which is designed so you spray it on, then you rub it with a with the sponge, gurney it off. But then they've got another one that's called Final Touch. Um, it's pretty much like a spray on wax that you put in a snow foam cannon. You let it sit, hose it off, then you dry it. But you can, with all the polar like range of the Auto Gleam, you can practically wash a car without even touching it. Except when you dry it, you use a um, an air blower, which, yeah, noisy, especially if you're doing it at 6.30 in the morning, which I'm doing at about time is uh, it's about 9.30 in the morning. So people are not going to be happy, but, ah, like, example, shine. Look at that. That's just insane how well that's actually came out. So, and that is not polishing, waxing, nothing. That's just literally spray on, let it sit, gurney it, and spray it off with a pressure washer. Uh, for people who want to know, I'm using a gurney classic 105.5. It does the job. And I'm using the Bowden Zone foam cannon cartridge bottle because the bottle that came with it was shot. It actually was stripped. That heads up, this stuff does make a mess. And it will be there for hours. I've used this stuff before and it's there for hours. Like literally a couple of hours, easy. Okay guys, that's gonna be it for today. Um, remember to like, subscribe, and comment what you wanna see next. And I'll see you guys in the next video.